Gibson, the choreographer from the movie Honey. And my job was to turn some of the actors into great hip hop dancers. So today on this DVD, I've been asked to share some of my secrets with you. Now remember, with hip hop, it's all about the feel and the flow and listening to the music and letting the beat take you there. So we're going to show you a little routine, one of them that was featured in the movie that's known as Honey Style and a part of her choreography. So remember, with hip hop, feel the beat, let the music take you, and most importantly, have a great time. Stand up. Shake it off, put the remotes down, and let's go. Okay, now it's time for you to get busy. So get on up. I'm going to show you what we're about to do. JD, give me some love. Woo! Five, six, seven, eight. I'm just too much. I flow too sick. I'll be on top of the snail over the kill. Been one with the drum tap, the purple start pushing my lungs back. Been there, done that. My words stick to you like. All right, let's go. Um, let me see. Goose, come on, Michelle, come on, come on, me up. So we're gonna start with the first step. Remember to always keep your hands in a cross formation. We go one and two is the first step. Okay, one and two. Very good. Now you take two steps going back to the right. Three, four. Okay, from this position, bring the right leg to the left leg. Five, six, adding your shoulder and closing your right leg to your left leg. Five, six. Got it? All right, let's add the beginning step. Remember to keep your hands in a cross formation, okay? Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, one and two. Step three, four, five, six. From this position, we're going to jump backwards like this and kick the right foot forward. Jump. You got that? Now we're going to add our arms and throw them out. And this step, you can have a little attitude when you do it, you know. From the jump, really quickly, don't stop. Seven, go forward and eight, right, left. Stay focused, let's run it again from the top without music, okay? Here we go. Five. Six, seven, eight, one and two, three, four, five, six, jump, seven and eight. Go with the beat of the music. Five, six, seven, eight, one and two, four, jump, and eight. Very nice. Okay, I know it seems difficult. But we're almost done. We've got to add the ending part of our routine. So you're going to take the right elbow, rock it to the right. Left, right, drop. Yeah? This is your ending position. Your right leg is slightly behind your left, and your hands accent out, OK? Just like that, with a snap for a little flare. And you can have either Gooby's rhythm or Michelle's rhythm. With hip hop, it's all about how you feel your way through it. And we go right. Left, right, and hit. Here we go. Ten, five, six, seven, eight, two, four, six, eight, right, left, and hit. Let's go. Okay, every hip hop routine has to have a great ending. Okay, here we go. From your ending position, I want you to kick the left leg out, stepping onto your right. That's a transfer of weight onto your right. Here you go. And one, and two. Okay? From here again, and the hands are going out. So you go one, left, right. Very good. And when you use the hands, just accent them out. Just let them go. Just throw them out to the side as you feel it. Okay? Moving on from here, you're going to pop the right knee forward. Three, and pop, pop, and bring your right leg to your left leg. Here we go, from this position. Five, six, seven, eight. 
One and two, three and four. Then, five, roll the body, six, seven, hit. And close your hands, just like that. Like it's done. Like you got it, okay? Okay, now somehow we've gotta put it all together, okay? Don't be afraid, you can always press pause, rewind, press play, and slow me down at home if you'd like to. DVD in. I'm not going anywhere. You can always learn them, come back to them. But remember one thing hip hop is all about the love. So no matter how you do it, love what you do, and you'll be right in step. All right? Don't forget, drop the beat. Love you.